Hi everyone, welcome to Prep Fusion. So today we have twin brothers with us, Prabhat and Pranith. Prabhat has secured 164 rank and Pranith has secured 268 rank in GATE EC examination. Both have been our student for a very long time. So let's talk to them and get to know about their journey. So yeah, hi both of you guys. You can briefly introduce yourself one by one. Hello everyone, myself Sri Prabhat. Currently I'm pursuing my final year from the Indian Kaknar from Andhra Pradesh. I secured all India rank 164. With 62.33 marks in EC paper. Pranit. Hi everyone, myself uh, Sri Pranit. I am from the environment. I am currently a person of BTEC from Jain to Kaknada. I pursued, uh, I got uh, e AR 268 rank from EC this year. Okay, so you guys, when did you actually guys start preparing for gate examination? In my third semester. Eh? Third semester, sir. Okay, so how did you actually get to know about the examination? Like, uh, did you already know about it or? How did it, it started? All in know about it, sir. All in know about it. Okay, okay. Elder brothers uh, suggested me to prepare for gate. Okay, okay. So, what was your marks in third year? How much did you get in third year? 42 marks, sir. Okay, and about you, Puneet? 38 point something, sir. Oh, yeah, sorry, in term of Okay, okay. So, what are the things that you did in fourth year to improve the marks? How did you improve the marks? Like, I mean, did you actually start? We mostly focused on test series, sir. We mostly focused on test series and uh, more practice and concept building. Like, transient part required more concept understanding, no, sir. Yeah. So, we covered from perfusion and uh, watched each and every video twice or twice. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so, how did you find it? Was there, was there something different? Or? Yes, sir. Very unique and uh, excellent, I, I would say. Okay, great, great. So, what all subjects did you follow from Prep Fusion? Uh, Prabhat can go first. Electromagnetics, analog circuits, digital circuits, max aptitude, and uh, that's it, sir. Okay, okay. And Pranit, what about you? Let's say, say, same, sir, except control system, whatever the lectures that are posted in Prep Fusion, we have followed each and every video, sir. Okay, okay, great, great. So, what was your revision strategy? Like, how did you actually revise the subject, completing all the syllabus and then revising everything? How did you do that? Actually, completed our syllabus in third year itself, sir, except EMFT. Okay. After the gate result in third year, we started EMFT and completed it within one month. Okay. After after that, we get to know about perfusion and uh, for revision, we followed like analog digital, we followed perfusion and revised it through the videos, sir, as you said in one video. Yeah. He revised it through videos and uh, practice more and more using test series, sir. Okay, so what was your usual performance in the test series? Because uh, I have been in touch with you guys, so you used to perform pretty good in the test series, right? So yes, sir, yes, sir. What was your performance? Pravat can go first. Almost in every test, we used to score eighty percent of the marks, sir. Always in top five, even at top topic test or subject test. Yeah, you have been also in the top marks, and same goes for Panita as well, right? Yes, yes, sir. Sir, almost in every exam, we will usually get uh, good marks, sir. Yeah, but what happened in the final examination then? Hmm. Pranit can go first. What really happened? Like, uh, where the issue sir, yeah, in Exam times and uh, more expectations, sir. This year, more there are more expectations uh, when compared to last year. Because we prepared very well this year, so definitely we have some expectations. This many marks they will get out, that many marks. After seeing that paper, mostly we get panic because more MSQs this year and more conceptual yeah. part. But we have prepared very well with conceptual part, whereas the paper is pretty easy this year. Yeah. We side forward question and that question. And in exam, I was searching for some pieces and that kind of things, sir. But uh, like questions are very straight forward. That's yeah. That affected very well, sir. Yeah, so they're mainly overthinking, overthinking costed the things, right? Uh, yes, sir, overthinking. Yeah, so you can, you guys can, can like, uh, these guys have been connected to me for our viewers, I'm telling. So these guys have been connected to me for a very long time and I know, like, they were always in my under 50 uh, range that I was always expecting. But yeah, it happens, it happens in the competitive examination. When you go into the examination hall with the mindset that I need to secure a particular rank, then it may happen. Like, you also would have gone in the examination with the mindset that, I need to secure a particular rank. So that should not be the mindset in the examination hall. You can take, uh, you can understand from these people. Like they are very, very talented. I am pretty sure wherever they go, they will do definitely great wherever they go. And they will achieve something pretty good. But it is just an examination. In three hours, things may get messed up. 
and it just messed up but you know you guys performed pretty well actually it's just that we expected <laughs> better and you could have done that but no no need to worry about that it's just a examination of 3 hours so like uh, during the like during your preparation did you have any kind of uh, demotivation or anything like that and if there was any so how did you overcome that particular thing demotivation in the sense means uh, sometimes uh, sometimes we need to not study for uh, 10 or 20 days sir because But, of semester pressure on it uh, because of semester pressure uh, even after semester also it take uh, it took us very long time to come back and read for many hours usually we uh, all the study for 10 to 12 hours every day even in college days great great so how did you actually manage this much time 10 to 12 hours uh, with the colleagues actually we sit in the last bench and do in the work sir in a balance cell too yeah that's great that's what i always say i also have been someone who never ever cared about semester classes never ever cared about semester class and why should we care much and why should we care much about cgpa if we are going towards uh, gate examination right so yeah this is what this is really inspiring from you guys and uh, in the final year like you would be having your btech project as well so how did you actually manage that you also told me that uh, from 23rd onwards you are going to uh, prepare your project in a good manner so how did you actually manage with the gate preparation your projects and all these kind of semester work as of now we not started a project works sir because of gate all okay yeah pranit you can go you can sir uh, just now we have to start the project works sir uh, in the december itself uh, they have all, all members have started doing project work but we are taking some time to do because uh, gate gate and all this kind of exams are coming sir so that's why we are taking some time to do the project after now results are out so we are somewhat free now we can do that project Okay, so th- so there is a good environment uh, for pro- for like uh, gate. Re- there is a good gate environment in your college, or like uh, not many people are focused towards gate examination. Not many people are focused, sir. And uh, are the professors supportive? <laughs> yes, sir. They support a lot, sir. Because uh, that's why they sit in last bench and do something. That right. is kind of support that that follows. Yeah, great, great. We are two persons, so that's why it became easy for us to discuss the things or uh, like that. So that is an environment we have created with with each other, so we can discuss doubts or that kind of things. No need for other other persons. No need of. So you guys have been living together, discussing the same thing, following the same content. <laughs> right. <laughs> yeah. So Prabhat is one minute elder, right? Yes, yes, sir. One minute elder. Yeah. Yeah. So does he take advantage of that? I know. Something like that. In any manner, like if prep vision helped you in your preparation, so you can tell that. Sir, yeah, Prabhat. Can... In my third year, yes, in my third year, I have concepts clear, sir, but lack of confidence in while attending the exam, sir. This year, that drought was not there because of refusion, sir. I would say. Great. Most mm-hmm. probably, always when I demotivated you, I will DM you and uh, you will reply back instantly, sir, with a voice note or some video. Yeah. So there, there is no kind of demotivation for us. Yeah, great. Yeah, thank you for that. And Pranit, you can tell now. Ah, uh, yes, yes, sir. Uh, in whenever we are preparing for third year, uh, there are no not much of sources for us, sir, because uh, we only followed some coaching institutes or some coaching materials that doesn't help in the final year examination. Usually, the questions are side forward or very easy foreign based questions. When it comes to get, uh, that is not the case. So we have switched this final in final year. We have switched the some we have followed procedures, sir. In profusion, what is uh, key is that mostly you focus on conceptual learning, yeah. and uh, moreover, the co- questions you frame are very good. Some questions are beyond gate level that help us very that goes very well because we can cover all the concepts in single one or two questions that help us a lot, sir. Yeah, that's the thing. Like we should be more focused on conceptual learning rather than mugging up the formulas and all these kind of things. Bro, especially for gate examination. Yeah, it might happen that question turned out uh, easier this year, and it might happen that you are not scoring as per your expectation. But certainly, you guys will do really, really well in future, and that I can guarantee you today in this session for sure. Okay. And lastly, if you want to say any motivating word for your juniors, both those those who are watching you for the next year attempt, so you can tell that. Prabhat, you can go first. Uh, suggestions mean like that uh, better start in second year or third year, sir. 
mostly focus on concept learning because the gate paper is un- unpredictable. If your yeah. concepts are clear, if the paper is tough or moderate, you can easily crack it. Yeah. And, and solving PYQs more than thrice is not good, I think, because you are by hurting the concepts. Yeah. So thrice would be a very good number, right? What about you? Thrice, what? thrice is enough, sir. Thrice is enough. Yeah, thrice is enough. Test series is important, sir. Test series is important, sir. Yeah, test series is pretty important. So, like, the quality uh, of test series is very important. Sir. So, how many tests did you write down? Did you guys write down how many tests did you guys write down? One fifty to two hundred, I say. Okay, topic wise and full full test combined, right? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Same goes for you, Pranit, as well. Yes, sir. Sir, same. Okay. Yeah. So Coming to full test, we gave around twenty five to thirty on the January month itself. And your usual performance in test series was like you would be under ten, under twenty, right? Yes, sir. No, no, under twenty, sir. Always under ten. And it's not really easy. Of course, yes, only once or twice. Yes. Yeah. So always. This is what I always said to the students. Like, if you are performing well in test series, like there is very high chance that you are going to perform well in the final examination as well. I don't know why students underrate test series this much. Uh, test series is very, very, very important for your preparation. You get the complete idea of attempting the examination. Yeah, that's great. So thank you, Pravat and Pranit, for coming on this platform. Thank you very much. Yes, sir. One more thing. One more thing. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yeah, Pranit. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Even performing the test series better uh, consider some Senate test series, sir. This year the tests are not, not that good. So either it will be lengthy or too easy, sir. That also affected our final gate exam. If we yeah. wanted to take some good test series, then better for our precision. Definitely, Himachal will, will bring some good test series for gate and uh, other other exams. And for, for our juniors or other persons, I would suggest far of refusion because more concepts learning is provided here other than any coaching institute i have followed so many and finally we have landed here in profusion this is last level we can we cannot go beyond this yeah so like uh, uh, how did you find the level of problems like we used to discuss the level of problems and uh, i am i remember that pranit used to solve all kind of tougher problems that i remember like your score in test profusion test series was also pretty good although that was on tougher tire as well so how did you find the level of problems there? The level of problems are very good, sir. But uh, only thing is, you would only score good if you have perfect. You have revised your notes once or twice. Yes. Some some people only do the kind of problems that are only taught in the class or uh, somewhere they have done. But when you have learned this conceptually, they can, then only you can do the problems. It whatever kind of problem it is, you multiple multiple uh, subjects you are problems or multiple kinds spelling problems, and only we can try to solve it. Yeah, yeah, and, and rightly said, rightly said. Yeah, so uh, anything else you want to add, Prabhat? Boss. No, okay. Pranit, anything you want to add? That's it. Uh, sir, nothing. And uh, for, uh, for those students uh, who are working hard consistently and not getting uh, marks this year, I'm going to tell one more thing, sir. Hard working is hard working is ultimate thing, but there will be some persons who are having higher IQ levels or those kind those equivalents are definitely their persons. But the, finally our aim is working hard. Working hard will definitely pay off in the future or somewhere around. For those guys who are having high IQ levels, they will work very less time, but they will get good good marks or good results. And uh, working hard will be definitely more to main motto set. Yeah, that that's what I always say. That's what I am saying to you guys as well. Like you have, you guys have done pretty good, but uh, you guys have done, you guys have worked even harder than what you have got, and that I know, since you guys have been always connected with us. And certainly, you are going to do very well in your future, no matter wherever you go, in any college you go, or or in any PSU if you if you want to pursue, you are going to do very well. So this is what I always say to my students as well. Like you might not be the smartest in the room but you will be the most hardworking person in the room certainly you are going to get something pretty good in the future yeah great great talking to you Prabhat and Pranit so thank you very much thank you very much for coming on this channel thank you everyone for watching the video till the end if you also want to prepare in the same manner with prep fusion for gate 126 and 127 examination then you can visit our website and apply the code titans15 on all our paid courses and you will get 15% off the complete information regarding all the courses have been shared in this particular video which you can check out by clicking on the link that has been posted in the description box. Best of luck to everyone and happy learning.